Hello, spirits, ghouls, and whatever bumps into the night. Um, this is Belvin Baronet, and welcome back to another part of the um, Solo One Baronet. Let's begin this. Yeah, I did some um, EV training, you know, just to toughen up my ship. Ship it when it evolves into a bayonet, so oh, I'm not having such of a challenge. I'm doing great right now, but when I face harder challenges, challenges will become harder and harder for it, so. Somebody at my Facebook page says that I should train up a little. And I thank them for helping me. Now I'm going to crush every trainer that comes in my path, you know? I'm working on some synchronized tricks with my Pokemon. So. But we can get but we can't get our timing right. Let's practice against ya. Well, just letting you know. I'm pretty awesome with mine, so you probably will be going down. Okay. Even better, I'm like. Now I don't have to worry about missing, you know? I'm like, I can actually hit this one, you know? The other one, not a, you know? And he's out of the ballpark, just like that, you know? Yeah, I have to burn it and confuse it if I want to win. And hope it hurts itself, you know? Ah, oh, bugger. I really wish I kept that, um, suit, you know? Well, I'm going to make bunny stew out of him, you know? This is all I can do, I mean, like, is read it out. It's, but it's driving me crazy, you know? I'm, like, just waiting, you know? Oh, 
But it's worth it at the end, you know? What do you have? Let's see. They each each time I battle a trainer, I crush them, the stronger I become. What's with water bladers and normal types anyway, you know? It just seems to be like a thin to them. I cannot wait until you get some other moves besides ghost type moves so I can actually do something instead of waiting. Because I don't want to um I don't I don't want to use my other Pokemon. Um, because then I feel like this wouldn't be an actual solo one. This is the best thing to do against normal types when you only have two moves that actually work on them. You just have to work around it, you know? As long as I'm playing with my Pokemon, I get to meet all sorts of people around the world and trade and battle with them. Did he just break the fourth wall and tell us about the things that you can do with Wi-Fi and like... Oh, come on, Willy. hate it when you actually do confusing and it doesn't actually work, you know? No, no. I know it doesn't do anything, but I have to do something, you know?
I would just be happy when, when he goes down, you know? Just be with us, I'm like. Sweet. Something we can actually do against something, you know? And... Aw. Oh. I was really hoping it would go down, you know? Hell yeah. Chris is always nice, I guess. Actually, I'm probably not going to use it anyway. Off I go. Oh, what a cute little panchum. It's too bad we have to take it down, you know? Holocaustle. Thank you for using the Holocaustle. Landris Labs developed the Holocaustle to make lives of Pokemon trainers rich, full, and more convenient. We hope you continue to enjoy the fine services of the device provides. But don't become overly obsessive of it. It's almost, it almost like, um, our iPhones in the Pokemon world, you know? Where it's mostly like, um, face cams, you know? I think this is good, so I'm going to save it here. And I hope you have a wonderful afternoon and I hope you like subscribe or comment on this video that will help uh, help me out a lot and see you later take care